Hello darts nuts and welcome to Darts Review Channel. In this video I'm going to be reviewing a set of darts that were sent to me from Mission Darts just after their launch in July and these are the Rebus. If you check out the description I'll put a link up onto their site so you can read a bit more about them and also put a link where you can buy them. So let's check them out. So as you can see the darts come in a slimline cardboard pack and inside there's a little plastic tray holding the darts in a point protector and one thing I've noticed is a neat touch it's got the logo on the stems lined up with the logo on the barrels so nice attention to detail on that one and the come supplied with a set of the Mission Rebus standard shape flights. So the darts are fitted with a fairly short silver point and it's a classic straight barrel profile and it's got a kind of a faceted ring grip almost like a brick style pattern. It's got a fairly uh, short bull nose and has a fairly uh, slim feel to it. Nice thing is the grip covers quite a lot of the barrel just for except for that little smooth section with the mission logo but I think for most people you're gonna have a point where you can get some grip and it's quite a nice feeling grip it's uh, it's, it's not as aggressive as it looks it's kind of got an edgy feel but I would probably say maybe high medium maybe uh, more grippy when I come to throw it and some people may find it a little too grippy but that's quite an interesting feel and as you can see it's got these grip lock uh, stems and when I put the flight in um, when you push it in it kind of has like a a little bit of extra bite when you push it just past the halfway point and it's got quite a good grip on them so quite a decent uh, stem actually and there's your standard shape 100 micron flights That's fitted with a silver 25mm point. It's got a fairly short bull nose which is 3.4mm and the bulk of the grip is made of this brick style grip which has kind of got wide and thin rings and it's kind of like a beveled brick style. That's 45.5mm and then you've got a smooth section on the end of 5.1mm. Length is 54mm, width is 6.3mm. That's 23.02 grams, 23.03 grams, and 23.11 grams. A little bit of difference on that last one. And full setup is 24.7 grams. With nothing attached the balance is towards the front and with the supplied setup it moves slightly behind the centre point and this is the balance with medium in between short stems and standard flights. Apart from the very front and the very rear the majority of the grip is a high medium so 7 out of 10. I didn't realise that I'd gone in, I couldn't see it because of the flight. 
Oh well. The grip, as you would expect, it's kind of a, a bitty, edgy feel, but you feel it more just as you're about to release the dart because um, that's when it kind of gets that edge on your skin. So some people may not like that, but others it might be perfect for them. Just that little bit of edginess. But it is fairly long dart, so just as well it's got the short stems on for me. But I like the way the light kind of glints off the grip. So I'll try it from the middle now, but it's the same grip all the way along except for that small smooth part at the front and on the rear. So it feels the same as I'm throwing it. And obviously it's a straight barrel again, so it can suit any style of grip. It's not too thin as well. Sometimes uh, these kind of barrels feel a little bit too thin for me, but it doesn't have that thin feeling. I think that could be also down to the, the way the grip is like beveled, kind of raised a little bit. Wilson style. <laughs> Getting a little bit more spin from the rear, but because of the way the brick grip is kind of edgy, just as it leaves my fingers, depending on how I release it, getting a fair bit of spin anyway. I do find it more awkward throwing it from the rear on a longer barrel like this there. Let's check out the ratings. It's quite a nice elegant looking dart, so 7.5 and like I said before grip around about high medium. Weight match, two were very close, one was a little bit off but not massively so, so 8. Quality of the machine is very nice and value, it's a decent value dart. So there you go, that's the Mission Rebus dart. So that's the end of the video and I'll leave you with the gallery. Uh, I hope you liked watching this one. And I'll see you on the next one. Happy darting.